We've been talking about a beetle and its wrath now for years. Well, now that the bug has been found, Madison City leaders are announcing their game plan. News 3's Jessica Arb tells us uh, the latest on the Emerald Ash Borer. In Berkeley Park, not far off Northport Drive, city forestry crews are on a bug finding mission. Sampling branches off ash trees, the crews peel away bark, searching for evidence of a pest everyone knew was coming, but no one had yet seen in Dane County until this week. This is what we found. A private company found signs of the emerald ash borer in a tree near Warner Park. In a press conference, city officials said it was confirmed by the state. Madison Parks Forestry will continue to do branch sampling in the Warner Park area to find really that kind of that zone, that epicenter of the infestation. Ernie Pearson with Bassett was the arborist who found the first bug in Dane County. We found a lot of the exit holes. We started digging a little bit deeper into the trees, started finding some galleries underneath the bark. Um, at that point, we contacted Madison Forestry and then kind of went from there. His company is now already getting calls to check out private trees. Assuming come next May, the tree's still healthy and in good shape, we'd go ahead and treat it at that point. The city will now start a plan approved last year to cut down about 40% of publicly owned ash trees, those in poor condition, under power lines or smaller than 10 inches in diameter and treat the rest. The egg laying was somewhere in this area. They started out small and they do this serpentine gallery. In the immediate, they'll be sampling trees on the north side. This one, Cruz found, already had the ash borer inside. Yeah, no. That little grub there, that's the larva that will eventually turn into the, the green beetle. Something to see there. The city of Madison has $330,000 in the capital budget this year for ash borer mitigation, but according to the plan required, once the bug arrived, the city will need some $450,000 to treat half of the city's forest each year, and about that much to cut down and replace just 1,000 trees in a year. City leaders say at this point they are comfortable moving forward with what is budgeted right now and they will reevaluate as needed. We, uh, they knew, they said it was in Saw County, Rock County. It was just a matter of time before right. it showed up here. Jess, thanks.